This is an insurance claim that we had. A homeowner called us from the Eastern Shore. We're just here starting out with the beginning of the consultation here and meeting the homeowner. She's uh, walking through the house, pointing out some areas that she noticed where some water was staining, causing some bubbling and some staining on the roof in her lower area and also in her upper area there under that window. So you're kind of looking just to get an idea of, is this fresh? Is this something that's been happening for a while? You got to get an idea of where the water's coming in, where it's presenting itself on the interior of the house. So we hop up on the roof here. I'll just do a, a full inspection of anything I see up there. So I'm looking for tearing, cracking, impacts. You can see there where the shingles are unsealed and loose. I'm checking to see if the wind has gotten under there and pulled those uh, shingles through the nails and actually ripped them away from the fasteners there. So when a shingle is sealed properly, you should not be able to lift it at all. When they're you know, sealed down and the wind hasn't lifted them at all, they are sealed completely down, which prevents any of that wind-driven rain from getting underneath there. When I'm doing my inspection, I'm, while I'm looking for those things, I'm also documenting everything, one for the homeowner's reference, and then also in case the insurance company needs any additional information from us, we're able to provide that for them on behalf of the homeowner. So we come in the house, I'm sitting here with the homeowner, kind of going over the photos, telling her what I found up there, explaining how that happens, what's the cause of it, and, and, and why I think the water is coming in in the areas that it is coming in. The good thing about insurance is it's, it's it's a few more steps, but it makes it a lot easier on the homeowner. So what happens is we get to the step where the, the uh, adjuster comes out, he inspects the roof. He will then write up his scope estimate, um, and they all use a the same software to write up their estimates. Um, the good thing about insurance is it's completely dictated by the insurance company. They dictate the pricing. The only out-of-pocket cost for the homeowner is your deductible. So they do that to protect you as a homeowner, as you know, to prevent you from having a contractor come in and try to charge you too much, or they're charging you with cheaper products or anything like that. Um, they set the standard. We abide by the standard. Once you get the estimate, we just take a look at it, make sure that it has everything you need in it, measurements-wise and, and product-wise, and then we do it for what they say. And like I said, you're only out of pocket as you're deductible. We decided on a replacement there. This is the beginning of the install process where they're stripping everything off the roof. They go back on there with the underlayment and ice and water shield and whatever color shingle the homeowner selected. In this case, it was Weatherwood. So if you you know you had a storm in your area, you, you had high winds, or if you, you had some things hit your roof, some tree branches or hail or what have you, give Landmark Roofing a call. We come out and we do a free, no obligation inspection for you. So we get up there and, and get a scope of the damages. And then we'll let you know if it's something that you do have a significant amount of storm damage up there. We'll advise you on the next steps on you know how to file a claim and get a successful roof claim through your insurance company. And if it's something that's not, you don't have sustained any damage, we will provide you with a photo report so that you can have that peace of mind of what you have on your roof. Call Landmark Roofing at 443-230-5514 today.